On the 22nd of July, the exhibition Jesus' Most Beloved Land was inaugurated in Damascus. It aims to reduce distances and bring the Holy Land to Christians who cannot make the pilgrimage to the holy places. The main idea of the exhibition came in response to the desire of many Middle Eastern Christians who live in countries where pilgrimage to the Holy Land is impossible for political reasons to get to know the land of Jesus. Three Franciscan friars conceived the exhibition in an attempt to reproduce the reality of the pilgrimage to the Holy Land. The exhibition we are presenting consists of 22 panels with photographs and texts describing the holy places, the life of the Franciscans of the custody and all the services they offer to local Christians and pilgrims from all over the world. Jesus' Most Beloved Land is the title of the exhibition which aims to make visitors experience a spiritual pilgrimage. The experience offered to the visitor is also enriched by the relic of the Holy Cross which is present for a special permission. It bears witness to the one who suffered for man's sin and who rose again. The Custers of the Holy Land, currently visiting the fraternities in Syria, also visited the exhibition. I found the exhibition to be very useful from a didactic point of view, to help understand the value of our presence as Friars Minor in the Holy Land. It is a useful exhibition to present the life of the Friars of the Custody of the Holy Land in all its aspects, not only as guardians of the sanctuaries, but precisely as Friars who live in the sanctuaries, but also Friars who serve in parishes and schools and in social works and activities. Many people came to visit this exhibition, which is open not only to faithful of all Christian denominations, but also to followers of other religions. For us, Syrians, this exhibition has a special meaning. For us, Syrians, this exhibition has a special meaning because we know that the political situation does not allow us to physically go on pilgrimage to the Holy Land. For these Christians living in Syria, getting to know these places is very important, but it is also important to feel part of this Holy Land. Syria is also the Holy Land, the land that saw the conversion of St. Paul and the spread of non-Jewish Christianity. Ha visto la conversione di San Paolo, il diffondersi del cristianesimo extra-giudaico. On the evening of the first day of the exhibition, a prayer was held to venerate the relic of the Holy Cross that accompanies the exhibition as a source of blessing and as a living touch from the Holy Land. Thanks to the Proterra Sancta Association and the custody of the Holy Land, this exhibition has been set up to increase communion with Christians in the Middle East and also for those who do not yet know the Holy Land and the custody. <laughs>